Brain fog and chronic fatigue, when I have patients who come in with those two symptoms, right away I think of mitochondrial dysfunction. We think of three areas that are hit when you see mitochondrial dysfunction, brain fog, fatigue, and pain. And as that relates to longevity, you think, boy, if someone's got two of the three, they've got almost the trifecta, you almost absolutely have aging. You look at causes, and I always use um, markers or causes of inflammation to deduce what is triggering this brain fog and chronic fatigue. So we start with what is one of those eight triggers? And there's a, an acronym STAINS. First S is sleep and stress. T is toxins. A is adverse or inflammatory foods. I is infection or the microbiome. And we have microbiome in our large intestine and our nasal passageways uh, for women in their vaginal canals. The N is nutrients deficient. People don't think about, but additives, preservatives, high copper in the body. All of these are inflammatory and the last S is being sedentary or solitary. That's the typical approach that's so determining which of these are out of balance for each and every person who comes through my doors or that I interact with to say, where are your top two or three? And I've been asked before, is it one thing? And it's never one thing. And if I had to deduce, probably strongest in the out of all of those are stress lately and being able to regulate your stress levels and toxic exposure and burden and being able to detoxify.